you've clicked on this video because of the title. Let's be honest. You want to know which of the leaks can you trust? The answer? None. Hello, how are you doing? My name is Squid G. Welcome to the video. I say what I mean, I mean what I say. I'm very sorry for that serious intro. You've clicked on this video because you want to know the answer. I'm sorry. Okay, so I've got my notes prepared. This is going to be completely on script, this video. Is it? F we don't do that here. You'll all be well aware that the Battlefield 6 leaks have been doing the rounds. How do you feel about that? By a trusted leaker. Let's get serious now. I try to do this in one take, off script. Probably what separates me from everybody else and why my channel is real. No, no, that's not the word. Unprofessional. That's more like it. Unless you've been under a rock, the Battlefield 6 leaks have been all over social media. Every single direction I turn is the same. Mr. Leaker, Mr. Trusted Leaker with his Battlefield information and basically clickbaiting the crap out of everybody how do you call a guy a trusted leaker somebody who leaks things claims to have inside information from somebody but then goes ahead and leaks the information so how is that trusting so backwards the thing with leaks is if you're putting the content out there just for clicks you're going to be guessing i could have said the same things that were leaked because it's stuff we already know. It is stuff that the fans desire. A BF3 remaster, 128 players, a battle royale. I could have said all this months ago. This is no news whatsoever. None. But the thing with guessing, you can be right a lot of the time. Think of a number between 1 and 10 now. Go. 6. Leave a comment down below if your number was 6. I guessed it, right? Some of you... I must have guessed. I really didn't want to make this video because then now I'm kind of promoting fucking leaks and I'm totally anti-leaks. I'm telling everybody basically and using my little bit of power, the little corner of the Battlefield franchise community that I have by my side, I'm using that and I'm telling you guys, don't listen to anything. Don't take it as gospel because I got DM'd a dozen times at least on the day of the leaks. Squid, Battlefield 6 news. Oh my God, I can't wait for a BF3 remaster. Bloody... But what happens if it's not true? You're left feeling pissed off before the game's even released and we've got any official news. Don't trust any leaks you see. Yes, get excited. Think in your minds what you'd like to see, but don't go listening to other people who are maybe just out there for views, clicks, and a few subscribers. Short and simple. Don't listen to any leaks unless it's official. Or from me, because I ain't gonna bullshit you guys. Thank you very much for watching. Take it easy. Peace. Squid, I have the leak here in my hands to the fucking feel sick, but I got to get out of here. I need a chopper. I'll be in touch, Squid. <laughs>